Hey everybody, welcome back to Marvel Minute News. It's Allie and I just got back from the Spider-Man No Way Home movie and wow. Warning, there will be spoilers in this video so if you haven't seen it yet, please click away. After over a year of talking about this film, it is exciting to see what finally came of it. This movie was overall incredible and full of so many details that made it so special. Obviously, a huge rumor was whether or not all three Spider-Men would be in this film, and that was the case. Tom Holland, Tobey Maguire, and Andrew Garfield made this film super special with their details that they brought in from their older movies, bringing them all together and talking about them among each other. When all three Spider-Men unite, they talk about their struggles from each of their movies, and it's a very emotional time. Tom Holland is obviously upset about Aunt May's death at this time, and he says it's his fault. Well, Tobey Maguire also mentions Uncle Ben's death and how it was his fault. And then on top of that, Andrew Garfield mentions Gwen Stacy's death and how that was his fault. This is one of my favorite parts in the movie because it shows all three Spider-Men connect emotionally and then it leads to Andrew Garfield catching Tom Holland's MJ, AKA Zendaya, as she's falling off the side of the building obviously bringing memories of Gwen Stacy and he just starts crying because, well, it's just so special. The villains were insane. They did a good job on not only having them play their character, but also bringing lots of humor into them as well. They did such a good job with the action part of this movie between the Spider-Men flying all over the place and each of the villains using their abilities. And of course, we always love to see the new suit. Another one of my favorite parts were when all three Spider-Men pointed at each other just like the meme. This movie nailed the superhero vibes with the action, the emotion, the romance, all of the above was just amazing. I do have to say that I'm so sad about MJ at the end of the movie and I can't wait to see what happens next. Comment down below your favorite part about this movie and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more updates on Marvel Minute News.